We are back. Looks like everything's working. Okay. So I was going to head this way, head for a general store so I could dump some stuff and make some space for extra items. I think he was this direction, if I remember right. Like in one of those buildings. Not here exactly. Magic training dummy, that'd be nice. see what I have equipped. I have right now the coral crossbow. Okay, so I have the right. I think it was over in this door. I have a, a sensor. It's a, what is this open door? It's very open. No ammo equipped. I have, I thought I had arrows. Can I get rid of those? Let's go this way. Wrong weapon, I suppose. Mm. Makeover mage. What is that? I can change your physical appearance. Sure. This guy, if I want to change my appearance, good for him. Not what I want to do. I should equip something I can actually use, though. There we go. King Blade. So if this guy attacks me, well, let's do practice attack real quick. This giant sword. Wow. Took me like three hits. He's a level 11. Taking bones. I don't even have space for bones. I should need a general store instead. And then I need to memorize where that general store is. Oh, there's a bank up here. Banks up here. That'll work for now. That's the banks right here. Oh, use bank chest. That's an interesting looking bank. It's just a giant chest. Alrighty. Let's dump some stuff. We can dump this. I want to sell it, but I don't have a good place to sell it. I wish I could just sell it anywhere I am. Two. Pathfinder cave. Okay. Coral crossbow, we need that. Newcomer map, I took a picture, we can move on. Oh, bronze arrows, I could equip those. Quick bow, I got a coral crossbow that was probably better. It says twin shot, I don't know if that's better. Let's keep that. I don't know what to do with it in find. Tiny plated bronze salvage. This bank is going to be filled up. Staff of error. So we have two staffs. We have a staff of water, which is better, and a staff of air, which is weak. And a banner of armadin. Oh, we can use that to like call somebody or something. Logs, sure. Security book, don't need that. Collection log. Do I have to have that on me, or can I look at that later? Well, let's put it there and maybe I can. Oddments. This gets me discounts on random stuff. Rope. Mm, that's some space. This is an old weapon I can get rid of.
Pickaxe. That's probably for mining, yeah. Alright, well that's better. That, that'll do what I needed to do. Now I need to figure out how to get back where I was. I think it was this direction. Somewhere around here is the raptor. It's fine. White knight. Raptor, here he is. We found him. You found me. What now? Fairly well. Then new target. Great strength. Neck. Fuck the seal. Okay, the seal. He's probably in that place where I was like a zombie. Yeah, take this. 50 coral crossbone bolts. White okay. Knight say you can get more in the cave. No careful of myself. I prefer my flame. And Remora's necklace. Well, let's wield the bolts. Let's wield the crossbow. I think that did what I needed to do. And let's... Oh, teleport her necklace. Huh. I have a necklace that does something. Is that the amulet of potency? Plus two prayer bonus and plus two armor. Let's teleport it and see what happens. Whoa. It moves me to here. Ah. Bro, I knew I need to talk to him for something else. Let's find Lucille. We can. Like to buy some gold jewelry. Not that rich. Get out then. I want to riffraff in here. Alright, so Grom is not in, in use. Alright, now we need to find Lucia. I can't remember what she is. Who is this? We have a Betty and a Mugger. Don't go in there. Okay, I'll attack you. I don't keep you. I feel like I'm in a town and I need to get out of the town. The seal was probably the lady with the two guys that were like passed out in that inn in the corner. These pictures are so tiny. It's like in the back corner of some area. Let's try this back corner. This is Betty that I just was talking to. Lots of animals over there. sense that it's this town, next town over, up here. 
like past here. I don't see the cave or anything, but I have a feeling it's up in this area somewhere. Let us see. Achievement complete. Beware of Pigzilla. Talk to me. Miss Schism. Old wise old man lives in this village. You might be able to help. Have you heard the news? Tell me about the news. There's too much to tell at once. What would you like to hear first? The vampire, the bank of the battlefield. Tell me about the vampire. It's terrible, absolutely terrible. These poor people. What is terrible? Why the attacks? The vampire is attacking people? Yes, haven't you been listening? And no one is lifting a finger to do anything about it. Oh, that new couple, Morgan and Maris. They think we should find the Vampire Slayer. But it's not... I'm not sure I trust them. They aren't local. Who are you? I'm a concerned citizen in Draymor Drainer Village. Ever since the council allowed these farmers to set up their stalls here, we had a constant flow of thieves and murderers through our fair village, and I decided that someone had to stand up and keep an eye on the situation. Also do voluntary work for the Drainer Mayor Restoration Fund. We're campaigning to have Drainer Manor, Manor turned into a museum before the wet rot destroys it completely. Right. go with, tell me about the bank. What about the bank? It's terrible, absolutely terrible, those poor people. Okay, yeah. And who would have ever thought such an old, sweet old gentleman would do such a thing? I really don't know what you're talking about. Oh my dear, have you not heard? At this rate, I don't think I want to know. Oh, you must quickly go and speak to the bank guard outside the bank. He'll tell you all about all about it. Ooh, such a shock it was. Tell me about the news. Tell me about the battlefield. Oh, yes, it's a great tourist attraction. It provides our village. Our little village is very important. Let's check the event notice board. The event is now ended. Prod and jam bomb. How did that pig give me an electric shock? Oh, here we are at the bank. Deposit, deposit box. Achievement, money down the drain. Achievement complete. Here, this the achievement is I talk to the bank. Talk to the bank guard, you told me to. Yeah. Can I deposit my stuff here? The wall doesn't look very good. I don't want anything. Hello, can I deposit my stuff here? No, I'm a security guard and a bank clerk. The wall doesn't look very good. No, it doesn't. Are you going to tell me what happened? I could do. 
Okay, go on. Someone smashed the wall when they were robbing the bank. Someone's robbed the bank? Yes. Well, but was anyone hurt? Did they get anything valuable? Yes, but we were able to get more staff and mend the wall easily enough. The bank has already replaced all the stolen items that belong to customers. Oh, good. But the bank staff got hurt? Yes, but the new ones are just as good. You're not very nice, are you? No one's expecting me to be nice. Anyway, so someone's robbed the bank? Yes. Do you know who did it? We are fairly sure that we know who the robber was. The security recording was damaged in the attack, but it still shows his face clear enough. You got a security recording? Yes, our insurers insisted that we install a magical scrying orb. Can I see the recording? I suppose so, but it's quite long. Okay, show me the recording. Alright, the bank's magical playback device will feed the recorded images into your mind. Just shut your eyes. You close your eyes and watch the recording. Hey, get your hands off here. Pure P-K-E-R. You close your eyes, watch your heart. What are you doing here? Peek. Ah, now I can get- Oh, it's Merlin. Can everyone please not move? Hey, you can't come in here. I do wish you'd just stop it. My sincerest regrets, dear lady. And also you, sir. How'd you do that? Oh dear, another one. Ooh, a party hat? Just give me the money, please. Old man. Oh, am I? Ah. Arg. Yeah. Then you can stop spying on me. See that recording again, please. I'd like you to pay me 50. Go first. Okay, here's 50. Mm, thanks, maybe another day. Okay. Retrieve Diango. Item retrieval. Interact here to search. Is this stuff that people got rid of? Mask of the Troll. That looks like mine. Oh, you have to be in the member's world to take the item. Oh, okay. I'm going to ignore that thing, I guess. Talk to the town crier. Beware the vampire, everyone in by nightfall. 
Oh, sorry for shouting right at you. Vampire, what vampire? Hello, citizen, what can I do for you? What do you mean, beware the vampire? Our village is plagued by a vampire that lives in the manor to the north. One of the citizens, Morgan, I think, is trying to find a vampire slayer to rid us of the Hmm, maybe I should speak to him. Talk to Olivia. Would you like to trade? Certainly. They have lots of seeds. Much fancier seeds, like marigolds and onions. And... I can't sell anything to them. Well, if I were farming, I would come to her, but I'm not in the middle of farming. Farming gives you food, which gives you healing and stuff like that. I haven't really found any reason for that at the moment. Talk to Fortunado. Fortunate. Can I help you at all? What are you selling? Jug of wine. Bottle of wine. And I can't sell it. Wine merchant, huh? What can you tell me about Drainer Village? The village is quite old, but the market is rather recent addition. We're going doing quite good business here up until recently. What happened? Well, not long ago there was a battle right outside Rainer between Sara Dominion and Zamorak. You can still see the battlefield. Besides that, the mysterious attacks were being hap began happening to villagers. Some say it's a vampire, but I'm not convinced. Perhaps I can interest you in some wine. No, I must be. Oh, that's a big tree. So this is not the right area. I've already been over there. It's not the right area. Okay. A white dot. Already talked to her. This is a musician. No water pump. Meat goblin. This mysterious old man. Where'd he go? Did he go upstairs? He was there, and then he disappeared. Wait! He appeared right behind me. That was weird. There he is. Talk to him before he disappears. You'll do, Mangler 3M. Me? I didn't do anything. Er, I mean, what did I... What do you want? Don't worry, I'm not going to abduct you or anything. Honest. Nor will any of my other random friends. Tell me about yourself. I'm a mysterious old man. A mysterious woo. My parents named me Mysterious Baby Boy. I never felt just... It suited me, so I had it changed when I became an adult. I was adopted, see, they found me abandoned in the steps of this very house. So, you moved back into your parents' old home. What? No, they never lived here. But you just said, 
No, we used to live in that big house opposite the bank. Now it's owned by some young whippersnapper called the Wise Old Man. So I can't enjoy my retirement in full. What you used to do? Oh, it was great. I got to travel all around the world abducting, abducting people, forcing them to play my games. Abducting people? I'm not sure I know how to talk to you. Ask about his random. You know, I've been around for a while. You probably met a lot of them yourself. But there's a young nipper, yep, whippersnapper like that youngster in my old family home. I guess it won't hurt to mention a few of them to you. Let me see, who is there? First off, there's the beekeeper who needed help building his hives. I hear he's got an apiary over near Catherbury, Catherby now. Oh, and the noters, three brothers, Miles, Giles, and Niles. I bet they hang out at the Grand Exchange. And there was a Sergeant Damien. He's a drill instructor in some demon army. Now he's has a job at the circus. Next was Freaky Forrester. He tends McGruber's wood now. He's a weird one though. He has this thing about pheasants. Ah, uh, the frog royals. The prince and the princess of the land of frogs. They just got married. The mime found work in Falador's party room. He's not very talkative, but he's a friendly chap. Old Captain Ray. Arnov has retired now from his pirating days and bought himself a house in Bermhaven. The sandwich lady had run in with the law. Last I heard, she'd set up the stall in Ardogny Market. Oh, and Leo, the grave digger, also in Ardogny these days. He got a new job in the church there. Then there's Mr. Mordo. He has a new job at Bark Museum. Professor of Unnatural History. Very impressive. The twins, Molly and Moira, are sharing a home in Varrock slum area. The pillory guards, now guarding all the pillories, all day, every day. Poor old Prison Pete had a bit of an episode. He's requested a room in Portsome Jail. Phew, there used to be even some older ones, but my mind's not what it used to be. Why, what did it used to be? Never mind, forget I asked. What's in the trapdoor? No, don't even think about going in there, it's off limits. Okay, don't need to bite my head off. What's in there anyway? In your business. Why mention abductions? Oh, sorry. You may not know that about me. It's something I used to do in my old job. There were a few of us. You abducted people? You don't say it like that. It wasn't sinister. We provided a valuable service. We'd give people a little break from whatever it was they were doing. Keep them attentive and active. We'd hand out prizes for those who completed our games. Well, there was one who was a bit sinister. He was evil and lazy and would toy with his victims like a cat with a ball of wool. I hear you can still summon him. You say three letters in a sequence. Sounds like an urban myth to me. What letters? C? I? What's the last letter? Say it. S. No? What? No! Well, you don't see that every day. Wow. Enter trap door. Of course I gotta go in there and see what's here. There's a pinball post. I tagged it.
look at the table. I think that's it in here. All sorts of junk on this table. A grabber claw, broken tools, a strange shrine. That's lit by a powerful spotlight. I touch it and the light goes out and then it comes back on. Okay. Interesting. Wonder what they expect me. Oh, he's reappearing. Next time I'll uncook that blasted cat instead. Why are you standing near my basement? Er, just guarding it for you. That'll do, Mangler. Great, that rat. Level up. Take rat's tail. New combat ability, dead shot. Oh, I can get my uh, arrows back. Take rat tail. Move all. Alright, so I know that I gotta cook a rat. Get it burned. That was a different quest. Where'd my rat go? Let's go. Alright, I'll talk to him again. Sorry about that, buddy. I saw a rat and distracted me. Looks like he's doing all the same stuff. Okay. Don't be a stranger. Come back to see me soon. talk to this farmer. Maybe he'll give me a quest to kill a goblin or something. Get off my land. I gotta get some wheat. Charge button. Take coins. Boot ball. You pick one bolt. I think I needed wheat for something also. He's not gonna be Alright, I need a wheat, I need a rat tail, I need some burnt meat. Do I have any meat I can burn? For that I probably need logs and a bunch of other stuff. And fire. A duck, I think we'll get some duck meat and we'll burn it. I probably want burnt rat meat. Advent calendar. Free stuff. Where are we at? We're on the 12th. Present here. Cerberus selection. Medium smoldering lamp. Blah blah blah. Use keys or why not? I have. Is that 17 that I have? Two. Cerberus rushes back. You can win the new Cerberus pet. Okay, I can do a farming, a fallen star, or XP lamp for farming. Let's do. Farming star. Sure. Protein log. Stackable log. Used for fire making and fletching XP. I need logs because I need to do a fire, so sure. 
That's 50 logs? Holy smokes. Out of keys. All right, Lucille, still looking for you. On top of looking for a key. What's that door over there? It's probably wrong, but let's explore and find out more exploration. Someday I'll know where I'm at. What's that? We're sitting on the thing. Looks like a prison. I just walked into a prison. Am I going to get trapped in here? Open the cell door. Probably somebody hiding in here. I just let out. It's locked. Okay, that was it. Sarah. Oh, yeah, I'm looking for Nadia or something like that. Sarah. Sorry. Sorry, Sarah. Elena. No, no, no this no, isn't no. right. What's wrong? I'm trying to train my divination. I'm trying just to train my right. divination, but I'm just Gloria not getting it right. Do it. Again. Investigate the West Colony. Hey! Ideal colony for your divination level. Requires 80 divination. Requires 10, 20, 40, 30. Ah, it's a map. If I go north, east, it's way more advanced. If I go east, it's extremely advanced. South, extremely advanced. So, up here, north and west seem to be the next thing, because if I'm at level zero, and then I go up here, that's slightly more advanced. So I wonder if I should go northwest, and east, and then west. Yeah, kind of follow that. Levels. Orla, she's the expert person I'm supposed to talk to. What's going on here? So glad you asked. I'm Orla Fairweather. These are my colleagues. We're pioneers researching the art of divination. Divination? You mean like reading tea leaves? Casting bones? That sort of thing? No, oh no. Much larger. We're dealing with the energy of the world. Fate of Gerelinor. Gielinor. May be determined by our actions. Wow. That does sound interesting. Oh yes, it's early days, but we have some exciting exciting results already. Can I start training divination myself? Of course. You could use we could use all the help we could get. First step is to gather a memory. The wisps of the south will do. See how you get on, come back to me. The if you first need help. We need help. Are you here to help? We need all the volunteers we can get. I catalog the discoveries here. While the others are focusing on the practical applications of divination, I have chosen to investigate the history, where it all came from. I'd be happy to share my knowledge with you, but I think you need some experience first. Orla has been making breakthroughs in her research recently. You should speak to her. Just spoke to her. She said go south and steal some souls. Here's some wisps. Let's harvest these. Gather a memory of a tear. No more inventory space. How many do I need? I just got three from them. How did I do? 
I think you're ready for the next step. Do you want to continue learning the ways of divination? Sure, why not? You've got some memories, but they're no use to you like that. You need to feed them back to the earth. Give it a go. Use pale memory. Ah, that's a memory. You should take it to a crater and convert it into either experience or energy. Crater, huh? Where's a crater? Got a crater in the middle? Convert energy rift. There we go. What an experience. Convert a memory or an enriched. I leveled up. Sweet. Who's that? I don't know. I feel like I'm getting At this rate, you'll surpass my tonight. knowledge in no time. Are you ready to continue learning? As you've seen, memories can be converted into experience, but that's not all they can be used for. If you focus your mind, you can also receive divine energy, a useful material. Why don't you try it? I did that. I got pale energy. At this rate, you'll surpass my knowledge in no time. Are you ready to con- As you've seen, memories can be converted into experience, but that's not all they can be used for. If you focus your mind, you can also receive divine energy. Alright, so I got the energy. I can weave it. Oh, okay. I need pale energy. How do you get pale energy? Apparently I have seven. Oh, I need twenty. And I need copper ore. And I need tin ore. Oh. Interesting. So this is like a combination of mining and energy. So let me just grab some more. Let me get 20 just so I have 20. Now it gave me, I can use the memories, but I already have 10. Oh, those just gave me experience. Oh, so I get energy and experience. I guess you just click on stuff and it gives you stuff. I just want 20. Be patient. This is like a little click, click, and click, click. Alright, so I got 20. Now I can weave it. Weave it. But I need copper ore and tin ore. 10 of each. 10 copper and 10 tin. What's this?
Who's Ned? He's got rope. Do I need to give him rope? Ask about the task system. Tell me about the achievement system. Very well. Achievement system the collection of deeds you wish to complete while adventuring around the world. There are special words for completing certain achievements. At the very least, it is worth a cash bounty from Explorer Jack in Lumbridge. Some also give items that will help complete other achievements, and many count as progress toward the set for the area they're in. Tell me about the reward for this lookout. You completed the Lumbridge and Drainar set, you're presented with the Explorer's Ring. The ring will become increasingly useful with each difficulty of the set that you complete. When you're presented with your rewards, you will be told of their uses. You may also see that what rewards a set item provides by hovering over the reward section in the Exploration Achievement set in the Achievements interface. How do I claim the rewards? You need to complete all the tasks in the set for a particular difficulty. Then you can claim your reward. Most of the Lumbridge set's tasks are straightforward, although you might find some require quests to be started, if not finished. You claim the Lumbridge set reward, speak to Bob and Bob's axes in Lumbridge, Explorer Jack in Lumbridge, or myself. Yeah, I think that would be like a miracle if I was able to get all of this done. Probably so much to do. There's a dude here, but he won't fall. But there is a drawer to explore. Locked. What could be so important that it's locked? that? The sun coming up or the moon coming up? Well, the moon is the sun. It's a reflection of the sun. So, yes. Alright, so this is I'm over here and I need to go let's look over here. Mysterious old man with a red talking. He's weird. Potter's wheel. This guy doesn't want to talk. Fire pottery oven. Nothing in the drawers. No more breaking pots, Link. Mm -hmm. Crafting level one, soft clay. Okay, I need soft clay if I want to make that. It would give me a pot. I have so many pots. Same thing. Pottery wheel or oven both gives you pots. Talk to Wendy. Wendy the witch is that. Oh, hello. Who are you? I'm Wendy. I'm learning the ways of witchcraft from Maggie here. She's very clever, you know, and very patient. Look a little lost. If you don't mind my saying. It's funny, I get that a lot. I don't think I'm lost, not at the moment at least. Keeping track of where one is isn't a problem, is it? I think it's more that I keep forgetting where I'm going. What do you mean? Well, there's just so many interesting things to do and see, really. Yep. It's all well and good and make 
make plans for myself, but I always seem to get distracted along the way. I was just talking about that. ADD. Distracted by what? Oh, well, you know, pretty flower, a little inkling flying by, fluffy cat, looks like it needs a scratch while under its chin. I see things like that. My best laid plans just seem to fly right out of my head. Hmm, I can see how they might. Have you seen the purple cat wandering about? Yeah, I'm quite pleased actually. That's an experiment of mine. You can make purple cats? Well, no, but I can make cats purple. Can you make anything else purple? Um... So just cats. Meow. Maggie, the witch expert. Welcome, traveler. What can I do? It's a fine day job. Something smells rather interesting. Interesting around here. Cha! That would be the cauldron that would. I'm brewing up a mean batch of good stuff, don't you know? What's that then? Oh, it's the most top notch bees knee socks off knocking premium batcheroo that you ever did see. By such an extraordinary brew is easy to make, don't you know? What it really needs is some sparkles, some pizzazz, some of the old razzle-dazzle, eh? Razzle-dazzle. Classic old-school enchantment, that's what I'm talking about. Cha. Without a bit of witchly charm, this slop will be just as useful as an axe made out of toadstools. Only thing is, old babe over there has the sniffles, so I'm not sure I'm going to be able to finish it off. I don't want to leave her alone with this in this condition. Is there any way I can help? Ooh, uh, I get a quest. Talk to Maggie about her cavern north of Dana Village. Why, yes, come to think about it, there's something you could do, Cha. Really, the only thing to finish off this old Rurooni is to give it a stir with an enchanted broomstick. Add a bit of flavor and spark, don't you know? So it happens, I have a broom right here. Well, what's the problem? Well, the broom hasn't been properly enchanted. That's what. Good stuff like this will only come when there are several witches involved. Betty, Betty, and Aggie are the perfect ladies for the job. Hey, I know where Betty is. We've worked together before, and we can get them to work their magic on this broom of mine. We'll have this cauldron full of something quite spectacular when it's all said and done. She told me to have them enchanted. In return, be willing to share the good stuff all around. Sure, I can do that. Excellent. Here's my broom, then. Hurry back once it's enchanted, won't you? Of course. Talk to Norman. Wouldn't pester Norman at the mo. He's a bit on it with Babe being poorly. This sneezing really gets me. Sniff, sniff, I'll snort. A chew. Wouldn't get close to her. How are you? She's feeling rather poorly. She is. That one over there.
Pottery guy, so that's not it. Don't tell me who it was. That would be useful. Hey, Ozan, who fucked him? Hey, I know where I am. This is the little village area, I think, where Lucille, I think, is in here. Please be able. No. Crap door. Maybe she's in there. Morgan and Morgan. Mysterious old man again. Oh. Talking to me over here. Over here. Yeah, I know. Don't you? Stolen hearts is a fully ghost poison. In a situation, you should know. Old Frank Crooms, his name, seems to have fallen in a new game setting up shop in Drano. When I saw him, he was acting all shifty. He wouldn't talk to me about it. I think he's in over his head. I need someone on the inside. I'm a bit too well known. Adventures with me tend to be a bit unpredictable. But I'm sure I'll have a few laughs along the way. What do you say? Need to defeat three level two mercenaries. That's easy. Hold up in his cellar in his house next to us. Knock on the trap door, pose as a thug, and try Knock to get yourself door, recruited. Pose as a thug, try then to get see yourself what you recruited. can find out about Noom. Any questions? I saw a trapdoor in here a second ago. I think this is the right place. It said house next door and there's a trapdoor in here, so I would guess that this is it. Um, what was the thing I said that made him go away? It was abduction CIS, right? I think that was it. Three letters, here it is. This was it. This may not be the right trap door, but I think he said upstairs, but we'll try. I heard a meow. I don't see that already. I just did it. Just checking to see if any of these can make it. Alright, so that's probably not it. I didn't do it here. Oh, there we go. Uncook that blasted cat again. Check upstairs real quick. Don't think this is it. I think this is a wrong building. Said next door. This 
could be it, or it could be that building. Right talking. now, Loom is holed up in the cellar of this house next to us. Knock on the trap door, pose as a thug, and try to get yourself recruited. Then... Great. Oh, there's a trap door. I um. Should have seen it. What do you want? Come on, I don't have all day. Can I pass, please? Open up in the name of the law. Let me in or I'll poke your eyes out. Or can I come in, please? please. <laughs> I think you got the wrong place, mate. What do you want? Come on, I don't have all day. Open up in the name of the law. Let me in or I'll poke your eyes out. Yeah, you seem all right. Come on in. Talk to Knew. Hello, stranger. Welcome to the scullery. I take it you're here to join the skulls, not for the atmosphere. That is to say, you're surrounded by skulls. One wrong word and your throat will be cut before you've finished saying it. That clear? Nod your head. Crystal clear. Gulp. Good. In which case, my new friend, you'll be wanting to pass my little initiation. It's just a few theoretical situations you might find yourself in if you pass. And if you don't pass, well, use your imagination. Now that the formalities are out of the way, first question. You see a wealthy resident leaving Draenor Market laden with goods. You stop and ask for your help carrying their goods home. Suppositionary, what do you do? Take their bags and keep them. Carry their goods home in case the joint. Make friends. Put her into the... Get put into her will, then call. Ah, playing the long con. It's slow and risky, but the payoffs can be huge. Okay, now for question two. A fellow gang member is wrongfully imprisoned. What method do you theoretically use to liberate them? Inside a prison riot, dig a tunnel, take their death. Ah, that would take a long time, but it's a solid plan. And if the tunnel isn't discovered, it can be used again. Okay, final question. A stranger disrespects you in public. What do you do, hypothetically speaking? Pick them in the hypotheticals, have a lackey's work them over, make nice walk away, find out where they live. Ah, the old unicorn head in the bed trick! You risk looking weak in the short term, but in the long term, people will grow to fear you. Okay, you gave some good answers there. You've clearly got potential. You're a thinker and a risk taker, a swindler. With your ideas and the skull's resources, we could be rolling in it. Well done. Welcome to the skull's recruit. Do you have any questions about the gang? Tell me what jobs you have in the world. As a matter of fact, three of my best are out on a job right now. A kidnapping, 
It's our biggest job so far. Plus, I get the bonus of sticking it to my old employer. It's relatively risk-free, too. We've got some lady backer doing all the heavy lifting. But you don't need to know any more than that. That's enough questions for now. I've got a task for you. Don't worry, I'm not going to get you to kill anyone yet. Just run some supplies to my guys. I'll fill you in when we're at our HQ. This place is just where we unwind. Thing is, I'm not going to tell you where our HQ is. Consider this one final test a practical. But if you can't find it, well, I guess maybe you aren't Skull's material after all. Kidnap me. I should tell Ozen about this. made it back out alive. Are you in? What did you find out? Tell Ozen about the infiltration of the Skulls. How do we find the HQ? This kidnap job he mentioned worries me. I want to ask him about it. He said he wants you to meet him at his gang's HQ, then run supplies to his mercs. So, it sounds like he'll be making his own way there soon. We should wait for him to surface, then follow him. That's how we'll find the HQ. Once we get him alone, I'll step in, and we can find out more about what he's mixed up in. There must be more going on. The Noom I knew wouldn't do something like this. Are you ready to trail Noom back to his HQ? Okay, I'll wait here for you until you are. Okay. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to put a cut in this. I don't know how much longer it's going to last. I've got to do, but thanks everyone for watching.